and say hi everybody welcome back to darkest dungeon 2 the binding blade dlc day two bring the duelist back out of course about to determine whether or not we maintain the progress that we made on the uh, crusader mission although i do kind of have my doubts onward once again though all the world's horrors bar the way Motels on the Moon, One Stop Chop Shop, Pond Jugular, and Lord Balkan. Our the squad composition today. Welcomes you with open arms. We're going to be rocking a new path here on the Duelist you as see, well, the Instructress. Even your valley is not immune to the spreading stain. Very excited for this path. In particular, I'm excited for this again skill, which this version of it looking quite a bit better. The other version was pretty good, but that version just looks bonkers. So, let's see. Her in the beginning, she's gonna want to try to avoid messing with the front two ranks. I suppose preparation is gonna be a really strong start for her a lot of the time, so let's do that. It's a stance character, yeah, no, get ready. It's been working out really well, though. I think it's, um, I think it is very fitting for the game. Ooh, yikes. I think we'll be want to upgrade toe to toe early on on this one. I'm usually uh, a little bit more averse to that these days, but given our need to Keep the Hellion in the front ranks. An unavoidable end. Makes a lot of sense this time around. Especially with her locking into the second position, I think that's actually not so bad. When we do something like this, she can do like a, an adrenaline rush or a raucous or even a in second toe-to-toe, -to -toe, I guess. A spark. And then bounce the uh, Highwayman and the Duelist between ranks one and three. And that actually works pretty well too. In fact, that might even be better. All right, now to see where our Crusader progress was left. Lower your guard, soften your gaze. It is safe here. Oh, cool. It did maintain our the progress. The Crusaders were known to cache their spoils at the point nice. share in their conquests. All right. That's the next good stuff. Leagues away. Plan accordingly. Yeah, that's a really good way to do it. That's the ideal way to do it, I would say. Is to just straight up give you back the item that you last had when you were attempting the mission. Really cool. Okay. So all we have to do now is find a hoarder. And then we'll be able to purchase the item from them that uh, presumably will continue the quest line. So we're good to go. Pick me still open here as well. If you'd like to be chosen for the stagecoach name, we got the pet coming up along with the bounty hunter here. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. Ooh. Huh. That is, um. That's a tempting offer out of the gate. One of the only protectorates I'll really ever consider spending baubles on. I absolutely feel like I'm going to replace that with something later on, so I'm pretty hesitant to spend all of our baubles on it right away. Yeah, I think I, I think I just convinced myself actually. Not worth. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. And of course, we did Crocodilian last time. I'm pretty sure I'm going with it again here, though, because especially with this team, I think we're going to be doing a lot of movement, and that should end up benefiting us quite a bit. A crocodilian for the day, Ninja Bear. Were you here yesterday too? Mubot has favorites. I think that's been made pretty clear. Mubot likes certain pile members. Palin will be joining us as our stagecoach today. Change up the livery a little bit, mix it up every now and then. Some strong biases, yeah. There's another name. I, I got to skip a name. I'm, I'm not even going to mention this name that I am 100% sure that we saw yesterday. And go ahead and let somebody else have a turn here. The shadows. The hunter is here. Let's see. 
Ooh, it's a gamble, but I really want to do this. I'm going to do it. This is this is not he wise. No past, no future. Oh, no but that's a huge pull. Gambling on the fourth rank bounty hunter. And we're blessed with the Raven's reach an additional 20% damage on range skills. Hell yes. All right. So we're going hurl bat all day. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it, right? Yeah, that's going to be hurl bat. Come hither a couple of marks. Duong on its own is a strong name. It's very true. That's a good one. We will be going with Wumpus, though. That's our bounty hunter for the day. We'll come on into the team. All right. Love that. Let's see where we're headed. Consider your position and plan accordingly. Marked roads is always nice. Additional safe routes. I could probably exterminate here, too. Let's do it. The shrouded coast. Isolated and drowning in amphibious degeneracy. I can never remember specific things like this. Are there hoarders in the shroud? Is there any area that it does not have hoarders? I, th I think there's one. What is the condition? It, it, it all gets so confusing. I swear there's a region you go where there's like not a specific kind of node. I can't remember if it's hoarders or hospitals. All areas except sluice, I think. Okay. Well, I know the sluice doesn't have that stuff. I'm, I'm saying like one of the main areas. I'm pretty sure in one of the recent patches, Experience, they changed something like that. However painful, is the greatest teacher of all. Is it no hospitals in Shroud? That sounds, that sounds right. I'm going to go with you on that. Let's do upgrade that toe to toe early on here as well. I'm wondering if maybe the uh, again upgrade is worthwhile. This would be a big gamble. But that, that whole extra turn next round with defensive stance, that just seems pretty nutty. Hmm. What else would we go with here? I suppose we could look at maybe take aim. The point blank shot upgrade would be really nice. Howling end, obviously, really good. Hmm. Watchtowers, hospitals, resistance encounters, and creature dens are region varying. Other nodes are not. Okay. Okay. Hey, Farron. Picking up where we left off, actually, so we're doing pretty good here in our quest for Reynold. I'm going to go for the point blank shot, I think. I don't know why. It just seems, just seems best for now. Let's get him fed. You pawn the most HP here. These guys are pretty tanky. So I'm not too concerned about our lack of healing here. I feel like they'll be okay. And again, never need to heal when everything dies immediately, right? Whiskey flask. I wouldn't mind giving the hail draft here either. Actually, it's a pretty solid one. Gets and baubles, paid for in blood. He said that thing. And I'm going to save these relationship items for now. Let's go ahead and add even more HP to the duelist. Less crit chance is probably worth it there. Okay, yeah, we're pretty... uh. We're pretty healthy here. Let's head out. Reynold better have a path called Templar or I'm refunding. I feel like that's a pretty safe bet, yeah. Let's do it. Propriety floats listless on the tide. Brined in noxious degradation. Back to back hero shrines is something I am very happy to see, especially that easily accessible. We'll follow that up with a chirurgeon's table and a lair, but worth it. Creature Den is where we're supposed to go as well. I suppose we might as well just embrace the challenge here. This is going to be a very difficult route, but. If it works out, it should be very helpful to us. Bear, you better not kill anybody. I wouldn't I wouldn't bank on that. Given our results yesterday, I think I had a, a pretty rude awakening or a pretty the rude return. The view is matched only by its unsettling awfulness. All right. I'm not going to change much of our approach there. Good to know what we're getting up or uh, going up against on the roadways at least though. Jeez, yeah, we're gonna Ahead, take out the wheels completely. Refuge. 
which is pretty Little awful. Bones and less identifiable remains. Given that that was probably going to be our primary means of healing, I suppose Sharper we'll see how this ends up. That we may properly excise our portion. Bounty Hunter wants to leave. No, we can't. Come on, man. We ain't bouncing on the first creature den, especially with that region goal. Gotta take advantage of the opportunity here. All right, let's see. Not a bad idea to start with the carrion eater. Make sure he's not able to feast on any corpses here. That's also a potential one shot. Ooh. And clears the dodge at least, get a little point blank going, or a uh, repost rather. All right, yeah, of course we have the crocodilian here too, so we definitely want to be trying to uh, move around a little bit more frequently. Preparation does still seem like her best starting move. I suppose a feint is also worthwhile. I'm wondering if in invert stance is going to do anything when she doesn't have one. I'm pretty certain it won't, but I'm just curious enough to try. Okay, yeah, that's fair. What I find funny is the Helm Trophy is a reference to something from the game's final cutscenes. Also, love how this is set up as, hey, the boy's out there. You just have to find her. He's just been lost the whole time, man. Yeah. Just waiting for somebody to care enough to go looking. He's just sitting around crying because he thinks nobody loves him. It's okay, Randall. I'm coming. I do care, buddy, I promise. I'll come save you. Mistimed, misdirected. So this is already looking really, really damn good. Obviously, the bit of damage we picked up here on the highway, man, is cause for concern, as is that stun. But overall, the damage has been very impressive. Ooh, that's going to be an issue, isn't it? Okay, so we got to find a way to gain a stance on her. So I suppose preparation will do exactly that. It's just a matter of whether or not I want to spend a turn on it. One less obstacle Regen. Ooh, is that from this? It is. Oh, shit. That's a guaranteed gained regen on a killing blow, which of course from that one came as a result of a repose, which is outstanding. Wow. Gear link. Tier two for 17 months. Welcome back in. Bear hugs, please form. Appreciate it. That's going to be a toe to toe. Here's a heal. Yeah, no kidding. That's from a path, I believe. Yeah, I believe that's from the instructor's instructress path we've got. All right, so we're going to go ahead and touche here. Clear through another block plus and get her into the third rank again, along with that bonus damage. You are going to... You're not going to be able to get to the front ranks, are you? We got taunt on her right now as well, thankfully. Let's see. I like this to get rid of the two block pluses. Very nice. This is a death armor token. It protects against the single death blow. This is a new mechanic. Ow, oh, howling ends on cooldown, damn. I guess an iron swan's pretty good. Yeah, this is a fairly recent change. The slow suffering begins. Going from a percentage value for death store resistance straight to just a token system, which as I've gone on record, I am a big fan of. I think it's a lot better simpler but definitely better in my opinion all right damage is getting bad here we do of course have the self heals on the hellion so we're gonna try to get the focus on that but it's easier said than done at the moment we do have the aggressive stance this time i suppose i could faint again that seems decent let's do that at least a little more return damage going on there. And then a duelist advance is decent as well. Uh, let's see here. We can get 14 off the Wicked Slice crit. That's probably a little bit better. Yeah, let's do that. Bravo. Work on this guy. 
And then, yeah, we're going to need to do a heal here for sure. Adrenaline Rush will get rid of the bleed at least. And now she's just going to have to hope that the... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, this is concerning. Let's at least get through the armor there. They keep going for him, man. God damn, we really need those taunts. Please stop. Please stop. You're being jerks. It's like they know. I suppose if I move her, or move her forward. Oh, she's in defensive stance? What the heck? I could have sworn. Okay, whatever. Let's see here. I think I'm going to go ahead and take aim again so we can at least get him a dodge and might have an opportunity to avoid at least one more additional strike. Toe to toe, we'll add the taunts along with the heals for her. That's nice. Oh, faint inverts the stance. That's right. Thank you. Yeah, I didn't pay attention that time. You're right. You're right. Um, okay, so the prep, though, we could get back into aggressive. Yeah. There we go. Now he's obviously going to have to just do a pass turn heal. That'll help. Okay, crit heal off of that is really good. And there goes the worm. All right, so if he was going to have a snack... And do not relent. Nothing we were going to be able to do about that anyway, so we might as well let that through. And then hi ya. No point blank off that, but that's okay. Touche time. Bounty Hunter with Raven's Reach is insane. I was really happy about it, yeah. Pretty pleased to see that pop up. There's the armor break, and then we say goodbye to the creature den. Let's go. That'll do it. Sweet reprieve. Ooh. Until the next test is put before you. Big hit. Big hit. Very happy we decided to do this one. Three mastery points. Along with full disease removal at the end of the region here. The loathing abates. Outstanding. Right, so. HP concerning at the moment. I think I'll go ahead and swap off Flashbang for Bodyguard here. Possibly also Stare Down, actually. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. I think we need a little bit more defense going on. Mule Kami! Thank you very much. Welcome on back into the pile. Bear Hugger. Thank you for the 22 as well. Appreciate you. Welcome on back in. A few more bear hugs for him, please. Appreciate the support. Ooh, a couple of, or more than a couple, a few glimmers there. Nice. That's not bad. We get our hero shrine. Let's go. Welcome back. Thank you for the prime. Appreciate it. Chapter 4. A taste of victory. We're going to be able to knock out both of the rest of our hero shrines here, I think. All right, here we go again. In the afterglow of their exertions, playful teasing gave rise to a contest of skill. I have an idea of where this is going to go. I'm also wondering how difficult it's going to be. Let's see. Can we even target these things? We cannot. They all have full resistances besides debuff. Interesting. Hmm. Cannot be harmed by skills in defensive stance, so I need to... Let's see here. This removes that from aggressive, so that's not going to work. I can shift to aggressive stance with this one. I can invert my stance with feint. I can get a block plus off defensive stance. I don't know how much that's going to do for me. I think I need to feint here. Yeah, that seems right. Okay. Now we're able to attack him. Want to deal as much damage as we can. I suppose that's going to be with the flesh. Okay. This is interesting. 
Hmm. I think we'll have to go with the touche here, right? Moving forward is not so bad. Uh-huh. Same deal, right? Yep, you're still in the defensive stance situation. We can't flesh anymore here. I'm wondering if maybe I need to get back so I can do another flesh since that seems to be the only way I'm going to be able to deal enough damage to out outpace him here. So I think maybe we disengage. This will put us in the defensive stance, but I think I need it. And then we can revert again. Okay, so he's going to get the flesh from that. That buffs his damage. Oh, it buffs my damage too, though. Okay, so that's why I had the double there. Interesting. Let's see. Oh, I could flick once he... Okay, yeah, that's not a bad idea either. I think we faint again. Cut that in half. And then... Oh, I have to be in the back two ranks for that. I see. All right. Don't want to disengage here. I definitely think I need to get back in the third and fourth ranks again, though. And try to take advantage of the double damage flesh. Which I'm 100% sure I'm not saying that word right as well. Um, yeah, disengage is not ideal here. It's also not bad. Yeah, this seems fine. Okay. We can invert our stance again. I like that. I still have the double damage as well. There we go. Yeah, this seems right. That's fine. Preparation. Okay. Mixing it up. All right, so he's got both now. Let's see. Um, so I got to do this, right? Is this going to remove his defensive stance one? For sure. Okay. This is going fairly well still, I think. Let's see. Can disengage again. That's looking pretty good. Oh, right. Yeah, but that'll heal me still. Okay, yeah, that's good. Flashette. Is that it? Might have done a helpful pronunciation guide. We are in defensive stance. He cannot be hit by aggressive stance. So. Do I just disengage again? Prepare for flesh out again? I suppose so. It seems pretty good. Okay. Oh, we got that 200% damage now. Oh my god. This will work, right? Yeah. Nice. Imperfect disengage. Aha! You are exposed! Hell yeah. Bye bye! Oops. She had done as he trained her to do. Flawlessly and without hesitation. Yeah. Might have been able to see that coming. French here, it's totally pronounced like flesh. Sweet. Thank you. So this will add a defensive stance and three dodge. Oh my god. Two taunts when defensive stance. Two repose when aggressive stance. Well then. That's pretty good. I assume that it adds the taunt immediately after applying the defensive stance as well. That's immediately helpful, actually. To take some more attention off of the highwayman. I like that. What would we get rid of, though? 
I suppose disengage is not super helpful right now. All right, cool. Let's do the last one. Soldiery carry upon the wind. That's not a real word, Wayne. The vestiges of an invading army scattered and lost in this dying land. The size of the helmet on the cart implies the Crusader is a Goliath. I'm down for him to be like a size two character. Well, he's theorized about those. It sounds like fun. Okay, so it actually... Oh, wait, what? Oh, the dodge is... No, no, no. The dodge is added automatically. So it doesn't actually do the bonus thing from the stance there. You have to have, you have, to have the stance first, apparently. All right, then. I think we probably toe-to-toe -to -toe here. I still want to try to keep as much attention off the highwayman as we can. Point blank shot's going to be a fantastic way to deal with these guys, too. In fact, oh, wow, we have, like... We have a really good team for this, all of a sudden. These guys should do very well at um, dealing with the barriers, which is pretty sick. Let's use a glimmer, too. Why not? Hey, Bear, does the new YouTube thumbnail mean you were the crusader this entire time? Yes, and I've been lost hopelessly. No one even tried to find me. Just been out there waiting the whole time. Excellent Woo! Work. Hello. A little stress heal there. Nice. No luck with the dodge. Nice crit return hit, though. All right. This one's exposed. Let's go for it. Or we could do this. Nah, that's not a good idea. What's our primary move here if we're looking for her damage? I suppose it's touche. And then he's got a duelist advance ready to go here as well. And that, of course, adds more damage. Which is pretty sick. Hold fast. For who knows what lurks in the beyond. They are really going after him, though, man. Did you knock that off? Cut it out. Uh, it's not going to be a need for a stress heal there. Get another bleed. Might have to get an adrenaline rush in at the end. Uh, let's see. Let's take aim for another dodge. There we go. This, this is absolutely going to have to be... What am I trying to say? I don't think I'm going to be able to do the... Um, the boss fight in this region just given how things have progressed so far here that is looking like a super risky proposition so I'm pretty sure once we finish this guy off we're gonna have to go ahead and call it just try to get the hell out of here do it bear stimulate the data economy they were well fed yesterday I see no need to continue to indulge in their desires. They got to see all of the blood last time. Abandoned or forgotten, it is ours now. That was a really nice pile of loot right there, too. Got three mastery points already out of this region. That's dope. Moving on. Uh, still looking for a hoarder at the moment, Lucky, which unfortunately I don't think we found a single one in here, did we? Welcome back. Yeah, not, uh, well, there was a hoarder on the right side, but... Oh, actually, I probably... I should've just gone that way now that I think about it. I don't, I don't know why I didn't. We must understand the past if we are ever to be free of it. Bandit! Chapter 5. Thank you for the seven months. The Perfection. Lore! As she slid her blade free of her fallen lover, the purity of her pursuit shivered through her veins. Sport was an unacceptable abstraction. The true test of skill lay in contest to the death. She whispered tender thanks to him for this final posthumous lesson, then threw his cape over her shoulder. Hers would be a life 
steep in violent hazard until she found an opponent worthy of spilling her blood. All right, so, so she's just a psychopath. She's just totally out of her fucking mind. Okay, noted. Good. Cool. The loathing whispers. I mean, she's going to fit right in, right? Let's take a look at these skills. Coup de gras. There's an execution one with a cooldown. Pretty big crit chance. Gain on killing blow. Clear skill cooldowns. That's pretty cool. Ruthless instruction. Requires defensive or aggressive stance. If the target has five or more stress, they stress heal on defensive stance or add stress and add strength when aggressive. That sucks. Okay, the well, nah, that's pretty good. Eh, nah, it's not good. Upgraded is pretty good. Upgraded version's decent. Normal version, not great. We'll combo with again, absolutely. It's just... Surface level, not in love with it. We'll try it out, though. I'm curious enough to give it a go. I think preparation's gonna be better than meditation, though. If I did that, that's not a bad idea. Then we have a way to apply aggressive and, de and defensive. We get repost from meditation anyway. Okay, let's do that. Cool. There are actual historical fencing manuals that tell you when to pull out a gun. Guns can't be allowed in fencing, come on. What? You can't bring a gun to a rapier fight. It's against the rules, isn't it? Well, the highwayman would do well, apparently. I haven't done a lot of dueling in my time, to be fair, but... I feel like it's a safe assumption. Parry this, you filthy casual. I know, right? Ew. Yeah, I guess we're fighting. I don't feel so great about this either, though, man. This is a... Uh, I beg of you, turn the coach round. Just because Wumpus is being such a big baby, we're going to fight this. Don't let the bounty hunter act like that. That's a repulsive. It was completely against your creed, sir. Right, let's see how they do here. I think we probably just want to start with a howling end, actually. Doo -doo -doo -doo. There are also manuals on how to bludgeon people with the lantern you're holding for nighttime duels. That's, that's just a wonderful sentence. No notes. Bafflement. And vexation. All right, early stun. Holy horror. Got the bodyguard up at least. Hemorrhagic fever, fun. A little bit lower move resist. All right, looks like we're not going to be moving him around all too much. Uh, let's go with meditation here. That's pretty solid. Get the duelist advance, get him back up to the front position. And another couple reposts. I like the stare down. Couple of weakened tokens, nice. Incremental, but deadly all the same. We're gonna need to do a toe to toe here. That is way too much stress for him, but I suppose if anybody's gonna get a bunch of stress, it ought to be him, right? Beautiful dodge. Nearly got the kill there. Oh, that's how we do it. That's what we like to see from the duelist. Kablamo! Another little bit of bonus damage. Let's go ahead and uh, touche here. Yeah. So move us back into point blank territory. Ooh, I'm really liking the way they're working out up there, too, huh? 
That seems pretty promising. Although toe-to-toe -to -toe is certainly the play here. But I think they can kind of still do the same thing, can't they? Yeah. Oh, man. Well, let's meditation first, though, yeah. God damn, that's good. More taunt, too. Okay. Ooh, pouch of lie here, yeah. Very helpful. Sets up another point blank. We're just a howling end here. Oh, wait, yeah, it's on cooldown. Never mind. All right, get all that locked in. And keep the attention off the highway, man. We're doing a great job of that. Might as well glimmer here, too, despite ruining the perfect level of torchlight. I'm also going to make it so we're going to do the creature den approach here where we uh, give ourselves a bonus turn by spawning the enemies in on a round where they're not going to get actions. Easily resolved. Like that. Okay, I think I am in a pretty good spot here. Let's see. So defense, I could, I suppose, reduce his stress. Do I care that much? If he has a meltdown, that would be problematic, I suppose. Yeah, all right, fine. That does make me feel a little better anyway. Well, another glimmer there, max out that torchlight, and then we are very happy to point blank that. Knockback especially good. Oh, the dodge plus is going to complicate matters. An opportunity. It's an absolutely howling end here. That's a nice dodge there as well. Good stuff. This is going a lot better than I expected it to. These guys are impressing me. This team, that is. Elementary. Got the pouch of lie to allow for the point blank again up front. I think I'll hurl that. Get through that block token as well. And then he's going to be looking like... Might be able to even break the armor there. Nice. Okay, assuming no heal. Ooh, that sucks. Got his death armor back, too. God damn, that's brutal. Let's see. Could be another meditation turn, but I feel like preparation might actually be better. Who is Fishman? Oh, that's the, uh, that's the Chirurgeon. But you can call him Fishman. That's okay, too. Oh, boy. Wow, that's a ton of damage for that skill. Holy shit. Nice little stress heal off that, too. We'll do this here. All kinds of repost left on this boy, although he's almost certainly going to heal again. Ooh, we get first action. Nice. That'll help. Goodbye, ghoul. Regen for the duelist. Not that that's going to matter all that much, I guess. Adrenaline rush time. Almost certainly getting the action up front. Oh, that's a big bleed for when we just use the bleed heal. Shit. Okay, now you're allowed to attack him, even though you can't. Does Adrenaline have a cooldown? I think it does, doesn't it? All right. Yeah, he's adding the bleed from that, too. Damn spike cap. Let's see here. I guess I can do something like this. Yeah, that's not a terrible idea. I think I should. Yeah, let's, let's play it a little safe here. How do I feel about again? Really good. That's plus 70% damage. That seems pretty good. Okay. Revelry's nice, although that is going to reduce his damage by 10%, but probably worthwhile in this particular situation. Oh, and then this. The combo play. Interesting. Ooh, very good. Speaking of combo. Oh, my lord. He cured his hemorrhagic fever. Thanks. And now with the maximum bonus damage. Goodbye, Chirurgeon. That went well. What a play, dude. Oh, man. The way that he... Uh, Tries to pick up his leeches and put them back in the bucket, dude. Oh, my God. 
Oh, it's kind of sad. A righteous action. There we go. Sweet reprieve. Until the next test is put before you. Pretty good, man. The appalling apron. Pretty decent. I think for anybody at the moment, actually. I might put that on the highway, man. Especially because we don't have any skills that are healing at the moment. The loathing abates. Seems like a good idea. All right, you have the bone saw just in case. Moving on. I like how the enemy's animations sometimes tell a little story. Oh, for sure. Love all those details in this game. The loathing whispers. Do you do it for the content, Bear? I mean, if we're looking out for the content, pretty clearly time to bounce. I am not going to be able to stay alive through this. Obviously, got to do the first fight at least. The Church of the Change. An inglorious heap of rotting timbers. The tonic is a restorative item. Yeah, it's just that it wouldn't really matter for him at the moment because he's not using healing skills anyway. All right. Apron immediately beneficial here. There's one fucker down. I finally have bare bongos on mobile. I completely forgot to promote that fact today. Yo, we got not one, not two, we got five, five new animated emotes to use today. Thanks to Twitch opening up some new slots for partners. Ain't that a hoot. Look at all those new animated emotes. Go crazy with them. Thanks to Cho, of course, yet again, for the fantastic work on those. Let's see. I think I like meditation again. This is a really good skill. I'm a big fan of that one. Cabin Boy might get Iron Swan here. I think I should allow for that, even though we have the weakened token. We also have the Hurl Bad. Oh, Cabin Boy X before the Hellion, though, so this is going to have to do it. And it's not. Never mind! I just had to doubt. Hooray! Booyah! Yeah, bye. Ah, the optimal. Come on now. That content emote looks like something I'd have on my GeoCities website back in 1997. That is 100% the energy, yeah. Nailed it. All right, no need to stress heal. Let's go ahead and give her some proper heals again. Yeah, that might be my, my, my favorite new one. I mean, we've always had that on a better Twitch TV, of course, but now having that on the official roster. Incremental, but deadly all the same. It feels extremely on brand. Forward and effective. Look at the boss loot. We're all we're getting ahead of ourselves a little bit thinking about looking at the boss loot, but I am gonna consider it. Doo, 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 doo. Spread it all around. Everybody get some. 
Uh, this could be a stare down, actually. Uh, in fact, on that, that's really good. Yeah, especially with the weak in there. That's pretty nice. Okay. That's fine. Do your worst. Gives us a point blank again, actually. Um. Oh, ruthless instruction point blank shot. That's pretty good. That's not bad at all. Periodic paralysis. That does suck. And he's a captain. God damn it. Oh, that was pretty good. Hell yeah, brother. Let's take out the fishmonger. Oh, baby. One down. Let's see. Could be a come hither to finish him with the point blank, but that seems kind of wasteful. Reset the combo. That's a weakened boy. That's a repose for the death. Let's go. Easy. All problems have their solutions. Even the big ones. Waste of a turn for him, really. Uh, we'll take aim. Hopefully be able to come hither. Can I move the enemy forward at all? I don't think so. I don't think I have a skill for that. Let's see. We could go again here, which is quite good. Sheesh. That's perfect. Clear the block. Now well, either highling out or uh, really anything. Steady yourself. Ow. Or maybe some healing. All right. Obviously, duelist isn't going to be as effective, but. Still pretty good. Oh, he just keeps generating block. Which shouldn't be happening so consistently. Excellent work. At a 33% rate, but okay, if you say so. Let me just go ahead and die for me, though, actually. That'd be nice. There you go. He hauled your keel. There's a hole in my keel. Lashing Tides I undervalued when I first saw it. Now I've come to realize this is actually one of the better trophies in the game. Leather Strop doesn't really do much. Card Bodkin is not my favorite either. Not worth it. It's not worth it. Not good enough. Recalculating one's odds is never a wasted endeavor. Yeah, if that had been a little more enticing, I might have considered it, but that's uh, that's pretty bad. I'll be sane for now. Especially the road battle afterward, yeah. Probably for the best. Will the daredevil start? Daredevil indeed. All right then, let's see here. I think we'll go meditation to begin with this time. I like the howling in, see you later. No, no new zones with the DLC, just new. Well, I say just, but we got new enemies, new characters, new individual quests, a whole new quest line to acquire the Crusader here, which has been a lot of fun for me. He's got a lot, but no new area, sadly. Yeah, the, the quest progress saved Fen, which I was very happy to see. So all we're looking for is a hoarder now, which... No luck early on, but I'm sure we'll find one pretty soon here. Oh, right, and the roaming boss as well. Yeah, that was another big thing. New roaming boss, which is really exciting. And a feature that I would love to see a whole bunch more of in this game. Yeah, let's just meditate. What if the new area is a secret? Oh, yeah, true, true. He's truing. Eh, meh. Not a big deal there. Man, that apron's actually doing work. Very pleased with that so far. The healing's worked out okay. The slow suffering begins. Ow! Oh no, he's they're, they're, she's stunned. Or 
righteous action. Okay. That's a little worse. Ooh, and the damage from the duelist too. Let's go, dude. This is working out. We got a bunch of mastery points from this region as well. Let's go. No gain is insignificant. What is that? Five? Six. Holy shit. And we still got one more thing to go. Not to mention we get another one from the deliverable. I know two more from the deliverable, right? Holy cow. Gonna be rolling in mastery points. A breakthrough. That feels good to start off with. Let's see. Yeah, I like it. Very close to death's door already right there. Let's do it. I'll take it, dude. She's probably going to get that crit off. Oh, that's rough. That's one down, though. On to the next. But we do need to be careful here. This fight's going to be... Uh, a little close. Might even want to consider uh, using that healing salve here. Oh, come on. Added another crit in the back, too. And the regen. Goddamn. All right. He's clearly the top priority. A master stroke. Good stuff from the highwayman so far. Nice little regen there, too. Almost certainly have to go for an adrenaline rush from that. Let's go to Shea again. Let's get some straight up damage, dude. Well done. That'll work. Holy shit. Just kill it. Oh, all right. Don't target her. Hey. Oh, all right. That's fine, I guess. Yeah. You can do that all day. Won't give a damn. All right. Got to remember to kill the altar first here. So that is new priority. Especially if you're just going to give him endless regen. Oh, wait, no, that's the tokens. That's right. He is keeping that around. I'm going to need to do a raucous revelry here, I think. Let's see. Um, Just take aim, I guess. That's fine. Yeah, actually, let's just do a duelist. You can at least get through the block there and then... I suppose I just hurl that, right? Yeah, that's fine. Crits for crits for the enemy all day long. Not that they're gonna make much use of them, I guess. Can do a raucous there. Very, very good. Uh, not much need for any other help. Although, oh, this will force him to do disharmony now, right? Therefore, prohibiting him from the first trumpet. Much better result. All right, cool. GG. Moving on. A petty hindrance. We survived. Sans played doctor. We made it through. Ooh, and that's a tempting one. This would be... Oh, I think I'm going to roll with this with the highwayman. The loathing abates. This would be pretty outstanding. I think I'm going to go ahead and give the apron to our duelist. Yeah, him ha him having the double damage point blank shot to begin with. I'm pretty certain we're not going to have a lot of fights go past round three and four, especially with the play doctor back in the mix. All oh, right, yeah, we don't have to worry about his disease either. He's not even going to stick around. You can stay disease for all I care. Let's go rot in the depths of the dungeon, buddy. Well, till next time, but I assume that the next the one's a clone. Crackles inviting the once again. Boom, villain. Sweet. A few extra candles. Bonus mastery. Hot damn. Rain, fire, and rot. Is there no sanctuary from this madness? I simply must go sluice. All right, yeah, we get to keep our raven's reach now, too, which is outstanding. Ah, but I can't use it on him. Nobody else really has a lot of range stuff. I suppose this isn't the worst thing in the world for her. Yeah, that's a decent bonus, maybe. Probably doesn't matter, but we'll do it anyway. Your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. Restore the stagecoach. 
I'm thinking I'm probably going to get our relationships going here too, man. It's looking like a decent idea. Wind chimes also really good. Let's pick those up. Any advantage is a good thing. All right. I'm going to get both these playing cards. Oh, it's so close to being able to get the songbook as well. Clearly not too concerned about food here. I really want to get this. I'm going to do it. All right, let's see how this does. I'm thinking I'm just going to use them all, man. F it. It's going pretty damn good so far. Wow. Getting guaranteed hoarder scouting could have been pretty useful. True. Remind us of a time before the end. Yeah, I didn't see that. Bummer. Oh, well. I mean, we'll find it eventually. I'm not too concerned about it. We'll get there. This has been going phenomenally well. I can't believe how well we're rolling on these relationships so far. So good. Highwayman uh, duelist here. Oh, never mind. Maxed out between those two. Oh my god. That's absurd. Plague Doctor Hellion here. Wow. Okay. We'll get that up to very friendly as well. Need a card game animation. That'd be cool. I'd like that, yeah. Holy cow. This is really good. Extremely high chance of getting some positive relationships here. Let's go ahead and feed them, too. There we go. Equip some salves. A little glimmer of light, I guess. Mastery time! Experience, however painful, is the greatest teacher of all. Start with the Howling End. I think I'll get the Adrenaline Rush upgraded here as well, along with the Rockus, just to be safe. Let's do our upgraded Roofless. And Meditation, maybe. Oh, yeah. Three Dodge Plus from that move is insane. Again, also tempting. Yeah, let's do it. All in on the Duelist here, too. We can go with the upgraded Indiscriminate. And then boost up the damage from the Blight. It's not the best here, considering... We're going into the Sluice at the moment. And I think I kind of want to invest in the Highwayman's damage, too. Given the new trinkets we're rocking for him. So, that was phenomenal. Let's hit the sluice. Can I afford a stitching kit? No, they're 12. Okay. Let's do it. What a power spike. No kidding. They're in love. While the heart still beats, desire will never die. Duelist advance will remove DOT from the Hellion. That's pretty cool. Aspiration unites the hopeful. Point blank shot will stress heal the plague doctor. Let's go. That's pretty sick. Hit it. Tread carefully and quickly. This is swine country. Part of me hopes that they never introduce a different line for the beginning of this region. At this point, that line is just like, that is the line that plays when you enter the sluice. I don't think I want it any other way. An impressive hall. Put it to good use. Impressive indeed. Chance at some loathing resistance here. A little whiskey. Peculiar pods. I don't really have a lot of debuff we're working with on this team, do we? The duelist, maybe? Uh, not really. She's mostly concerned about buffing us. I don't think I have any debuff I apply, do I? So this probably isn't really worth it. Yeah. Not very helpful. 
What if the new line is just Wayne going oink oink? Okay, yeah, that might that might be a winner. I'd be alright with that. What about a steal their food line? Don't we have that in some form though? What am I misremembering? Let's check where Plague Doctor and Highwayman duelist relationships are. I think we'll go with the Highwayman's here, yeah. Just slightly better. Works for me. Big pig. All right, let's see what our double damage point blank shot looks like. An opportunity. Squandered. Like nothing. Didn't do a damn thing. There we go. Let us hope to finish this quickly. Bear, how much money for you to do a Shaggy from Scooby Doo impression? Like, I'll do it for free, man. It's not very good. That's why I feel like I can't charge you. I will do this, though. <laughs> that wasn't even my best re he 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 he. That was like a, was a subpar re he 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 he. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice stress heal off of that one. A little combo blade, maybe? Malaise. That'll do it. Measured and steady. Oh, there's the damage, dude. I'll clip the mic for that kind of damage. That's exciting. Break through the armor. No meltdown, though, please. I'd prefer not to have to deal with that. Thank you. Very good. Uh, yeah, you go ahead and die for me, right? All problems have their solutions, even the big ones. Yes, sir. That's the necrophagia, but we should have enough moves here to prevent the crit from coming through. You don't have to worry about the Highwayman now being a nine, minus 90% damage, though. Shouldn't matter. A master stroke. But now can I heal him, I wonder? Probably not. We're fine. We'll be fine. Sweet reprieve. <gasps> oh, shit. Test is put before you. Oh, shit, dude. Lock strong box. 50 relics in a box. Let's go. The loathing whispers. I played a little bit of Lethal Company with the boys like last week or something, maybe two weeks ago. I think it was I last week. Ever buying that cursed clay from which sprung this anathema. Oh, 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 yeah. There we go, dude. There's some good endgame stuff. Hidden in warrens and ancient waterways, the swine proliferate unseen and unchecked. Yeah, Lethal Company's cute. It's fun, but not super up my alley. I play a little no bit choice. more. The brutish creatures must be confronted. God damn, that's a nice little buff right there. She, she is gonna be. He's gonna be hitting real goddamn hard here. Let's see. I might as well use my glimmer. Let's start off with meditation here. Like starting a fight by giving her three dodge plus tokens. That's uh, that's tough to beat. Play grenade here. I got very low blight resist after all. How's this look? Yeah, pretty good. Oh my god. He might just die. He might die to the repost. Okay. Incremental. But deadly. Stun there. You ain't touching her. I don't know what the heck you think you're doing with that, but that ain't gonna work, bud. Let's hope to finish this quickly. See you later, Piginator. 
Um, let's see here. Defensive stance, extra turn next round. Trammeled, trapped, held captive by fear. That sounds like fun. Okay, that's next round though. Understood. Don't you stealth too. Steady Through the yourself. dodge plus with a crit. Come on, man. Let's see. Well, I'll just reset the meditation, I guess, sure. Sheesh, that is. That is outstanding. All right, so unfortunately her double turn here is going to be kind of wasted. The enemy weakens and wanes. Especially if he's still in stealth. She absolutely will be. All right, I have Magrain back, though. That's pretty good. Yeah, that extra turn ends up working out pretty well, huh? That is nice. Apparently we can toe the to toe through the stealth as well. Oh, well, there we go. Bye-bye. Is that? I swear I've been told this before too, I'm sure, but uh... Oh, hello. I'm not even gonna finish that thought. Wolf's blood plus six speed. Let's give that to the duelist too, man. God damn, that's nice. If the highwayman had an open slot, I'd be considering giving it to him, but... Ooh, each hero in combat star has a chance for stealth. Analysis is invaluable. Until it becomes an excuse for him actually. Hush up, Wayne. Give me a second. I'm just figuring it out, all right? I got a lot of new things. Like, like chat up in here, dude. The loathing howls. That's bad. Uh, I really like to. Avoid that. Rummage through the shelves, laden with echoes of indistinct ideas. Hmm. I think I'm gonna try this one. Light sensitive. Abandoned or forgotten. Oh, interesting. Tin delicacies, first of all. Wonderful food item. Second of all, this. Might be better. I think it's a lot better actually for us than our current equip or currently equipped unforgettable on the highwayman. Adds a positive token when moving when of course duelist and point blank are his primary skills. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Wayne June more like Wayne Rude. Plus two. Those are my favorite Wainers though. I agree is when he tells you to get the freaking let out. But lollygagging. Actually, if there was a waner where he specifically said, get the frickin' let out, that might be my new fave. I guess I just hire him. I can make all these the things happen. Heart crackles invitingly once again. Ooh, Sandwin. Used to be a lot better, still quite nice. Bonus supplies. Got, of course, the spacious strong box for our stagecoach now, along with the ice box. And a bum leg. Well, oh well. Your coach must be maintained. Oh, shit. Carry you where you must go. It's the Wayne ride as well. Discounted repairs. That's perfect. A smoother ride. For a time, at least. Okay. Spacious strong box is outstanding. Get the ice box in there. I think I'm going to probably replace the, car or the uh, compress kit. With the carriage lamps. Reconfigure. Meet each challenge on its own terms. And the storage trunk doesn't really seem worthwhile to hang on to at this point. Let's go with. Where are we going, first of all? Consider your position. Nice. And plan accordingly. Oh, no, trade route. That's the one we want. Yeah, we want all the hoarders. Caches are good, but it's time for the hoarders. Let's go shroud. The shrouded coast, isolated, and drowning in amphibious degeneracy. Gotta get that quest finished, baby. 
something to ease the rigors of the road. We have two good meals here. We certainly need to get some more. So let's go ahead and pick these guys up. I'm going to get this whiskey bottle. Probably the flasks as well. But let's see where we're at after this pair of books. Wow. Holy shit. Things are going well. Duelist Highway Man, I'd love to be able to boost a little bit more. Not that time. All right. Let's try again. There we go. I believe that makes them friendly now. Good stuff. We can max out Hellion Plague Doctor. Let's do that. Yeah, it's just a new, uh, new uh, type of road encounters of Barry. Introduced via the DLC. Chance to run into those barricade enemies. Do I want the Adrenalizing Ash? I don't think so. Well, I guess if I have nothing else equipped, yeah, I might as well. Okay. We'll save those salves. Equip the Burn Salve instead. We'll keep the Laudanum. Linens are good. All right. Let's get them fed. I kind of want to keep these for the end game. I think I'm going to buy other food for now. Conventional fare. But... Fairly priced. Having some really good food at the end is always nice. So let's do this. Let's do... Oh! Oh, boy. That's not ideal. That's not what we wanted to see out of the slime mold. Oof. Oh, well. Off we go. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. While the heart still beats, desire will never die. Don't you have peculiar pods? True. Could chance the pod disease removal. Aspiration unites the hopeful. Magrain and breakthrough with the stress heal. Ooh, kind of a whiff. All right. Get the DOT removal from point blank, at least. Not for nothing. Propriety floats listless on the tide. Brined in noxious degradation. All right. The sooner we can get to a hoarder, the better. Not to mention, I really got to try to avoid some loathing here, so... Looks like the center path is going to be our best bet. And then we could also hit up a hospital immediately after that and get rid of the dysentery. So let's do it. And then we got a guaranteed order there if we don't run into one on the middle path. Point blank now shoots from both ends. That's good. Oh, yikes. The vestiges of an invading army. Scattered and lost in this dying land. Although I think creature dens might actually reduce loathing, so I suppose it could be worthwhile for that. Magrain, a fantastic option in this fight, by the way. I'm very excited for that. Let's start with meditation. And we're finally going to be able to burn these things down, not to mention. Point blank shot also going to be extremely effective. Should be able to destroy this, right? Could have one-shot the damn thing. Holy cow, adds a crit to the highwayman, too. Holy shit. I love it. And he's back with the speed token. See ya. Knock him out the box. Give him a little play grenade. Uh, pretty much do it. Clamor is going to debuff to remove the ability to gain block. Which is a strange one. Shouldn't affect us too badly. Ruthless. Nah, this is going to be again, right? Yeah. Extra turn for the mag rain? That doesn't really seem necessary, actually. It's a lot of stress to add for that, too. Yeah, I don't know if that's the play. Do, 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 do. Minus three stress. It's really good. I think I'm going to undervalue this skill on the initial reading, which is something I tend to do. 
Oh, right. Yeah, she has the apron. Wow, that's a cool little way to counter this guy, too. Okay. You threw burning magnesium onto a wooden war wharf over water. What's the problem? Sounds like an effective solution. Let's do it again, in fact. Bye-bye. Yeah, yep. Interesting to see her as a utility champ. Yeah, we're certainly uh, going along with the intended use of this path, aren't we? I'm into it. I'm going to try to get a battlefield medicine off here. Yeah, it's not going to heal, though. Never mind. Let's just kill him. A righteous action. Oh, yeah, we should get a gamma going. The one pleasant in the extreme. This work is noble and necessary. Here, I can do that real quick. Doo -doo. There we go. All right, creature den. Might have to knock you out real quick here just to take care of this loathing situation. Not to mention prep us better for the hospital as well. Here we go. Ooh, too stealth. Not really gonna matter, but it's fun. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Big Burns. Goodbye. Big David Burns. See ya. Meditation yet again. Hard to say no to that start. There they go. As expected. Ideally, just setting us up for another couple of point blanks here. We have the speed start yet again as well. Big boys. Hit it. Jealous Whisper crit. Beautiful. Let's keep burning through these block pluses. Maybe take advantage of that combo token. Nice. Let's see here. I'm pretty happy to just go with Touche. Yeah, I, I honestly, like, as tempting as it is to try to take full advantage of the Ruthless Instruction with a Gen and all that and get big bonus damage. Incremental, but deadly all the same. A lot of the time it does seem best to avoid piling on stress unnecessarily. We'll certainly consider it for boss fights and the like, I think. Um, let's see. Yeah, no real reason to do a meditation now, I suppose. Because that's just a stress seal, right? Yeah, this would be... Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Creature Den seems like an appropriate time. We should even be able to buff him prior to, uh... prior to his first action next round, especially with her speed situation going on here. A deliberate and methodical appliance of harm. All right, we'll get the battlefield medicine to cure that bleed. Oh yeah, we're buffing this up big time. Ruthless instruction. No, oh, that's again, that's right. Okay, see, I'd have to get rid of the cooldown there. I forgot about that. Okay, in that case, Let's just do that. Yeah, good enough. Oh, I might even just... We have the extra action here. I suppose I might as well just go ahead and... Well, no, let's take aim. Let the burn take him out. And then we could start off with like a duelist or a wicked slice here. Yeah, I like that. Let's do... Let's do the wicked slice, actually. Nice. One down instantly in round one. We'll clear those and get some dodges. Get, or get rid of some dodges there, too. Speaking of which, kaboom. All right, certainly getting the toe-to-toe -to -toe here. Tarantism, ah, come on. Doing work, my friend. 
Ooh, we might have to go with an adrenaline rush here, actually. Yeah, definitely. That's why we got it, though. Miss it. Whoopsie. Uh, that was a rough draw for you, pal. Not ideal. We are making lightning fast work of this creature den, though. Petty hindrance. This feels pretty damn good. Oh, yeah. You just go ahead and touche. I mean, even this absent her super utility moves, just poking him with a spear every now and then. Seems to be doing the job pretty well. Moving on, man. Wipe my hands of this. We are the flame, burning brightly for all the world to see. I don't mind discounted trinkets either, actually. I was a little disappointed by that result initially, but... A simple choice. That's probably pretty good. At least it should be. I know it's a rapier! I'm allowed to say things wrong! God damn it! It's a pointy long stick. I think that's actually the official terminology. She weeps for the fallen and knows she will join them soon enough. Oh, you know what I also completely forgot to do last time that I said I was going to do last time and I absolutely didn't. It costs 16 to remove positive quirks for those who were curious. Now we officially know. Go ahead and get rid of them. We can suffer no sickness on this pilgrimage. Good stuff. All right. Thankfully, we don't need to worry about the amount of relics we have for this since we just need the one piece of currency to per pick up the uh, Crusader unique item. Would that make this party the Order of the Pointy Stick? If that's not a unique team name for a composition involving her. We should, we should find the pointiest of sticks available in the roster and see if we can make that happen. He chatters incoherently, but his prices remain fixed. Though worn and filthy, the sword is singular in its craftsmanship. A little care and maintenance will easily restore its luster and its cutting edge. This gibbering creature knew not the value of his stock. The blade is a beacon. I like the way that sounds. I'm also going to get these. A renewal. Welcome back. Sin Victor. Hey, buddy. Bear hugs, please, for my good friend, Sin Victor. Thanks for the 44 months, man. Appreciate it. The coach's plating is spent. Ooh. We are exposed. We sure are. Shit. I guess we're gonna need to fix that. Here we go. Stress has really not been a problem. Well, you know what happens when you try to bear hug, but you don't have the emotes, is you get gifted a sub, because I appreciate the effort. Thank you, Renee. There you go. Get them some bear hugs. The newest member of the pile. Cooperation is the key. Magrin. The fiend's strength dwindles. Hmm. I like the I like the toe to toe here. I think actually. Uh, Locker in the front. Get a speed token on him right away. That is going to stop him from getting his move skill buffs going. But we can do that. Move. We just upgraded. Hey, how's it going? Gifting a sub to the apathetic one as well. Getting out ahead of me. Thank you. Appreciate that. Keep the hugs and gifts coming for him. Appreciate it, y'all. A breakthrough. You first. You got crits up front anyway. I feel like I need to figure out a better way to utilize her. Welcome back. I feel like measured and steady. This in particular is probably a time where I should 
start using things like again. Yeah, the extra turn next round. Yeah, I think that's the way to go. Let's do that. Gotta get through the weaken and the block tokens here to make that most effective, but I think we can probably manage that. And then let's not lock her in place again here. I like Iron Swan quite a bit. I think the DOT is just kind of matching up there. That's a good way to get through the blocks, too, certainly. And Mook says, thank you for the prime, a brand new member of the pile. Welcome on in. Appreciate it. Thank you. The hey, Astra. Weakens and wanes. We are closing in on it. I think we might have just acquired the last item that we need, or at least that's kind of the, the context clues that I've gathered from it. And ruthless instruction, still in a defensive stance. I suppose preparation at this point? Which I also wonder if I should upgrade that. All right, so here's his extra action round. This guy's already dead. Get through that block and set up a point blank here, I think. Well, that's likely to go into a toe-to-toe -to -toe again. I guess it could be fine to turn it into another duelist. Oh, this is adrenaline rush too, maybe. Yeah, it's definitely it. Little low there. Now we do that. That's very true, Axolotl. Yeah, you can unlock the bear hug with the bear bucks. Also an option. Yeah, we gotta do that, right? I don't know, I like to take aim here, actually. Especially with for being likely to toe-to-toe -to -toe again here. Or we can do that. A master stroke. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty damn good right there, dude. A couple more reposts from me. Get our freaking reposts and dodges reset. Everybody dead. They're dead as hell. Let's go. Boom, 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 boom. Shake the freaking room. See you later. Spoken sharply. No, thanks. No, thank you. I'll take the other impulse in case I want to go with double damage on somebody else, but that ain't it. Assistance time. We venture blindly forth at the mercy of the road and its myriad dangers. Obviously not enough resources to hit another hoarder here. Looks like an oasis coming up as well. Impervious enemies. No stuns for these boys. They are very vulnerable to the Blight, though. Large. That is a great start. Okay. Meditation again. Let's prep this time, actually. Curious to see how this could go. Incremental, but deadly all the same. You're going to do a run with Highwayman, Crusader, Vestal, and Plague Doctor when you unlock him. That does sound like the way to go. The old guard. hope to finish this quickly. Not a bad idea. Hot damn, dude. That's a stun trade there. You know what? I'll take Measure it. Out your violence and apply it judiciously. Seems good. What was this? Thank you. I hope I didn't butcher your name too badly. Thank you for the long-term support. Appreciate it. Right on. Adrenaline rush again? I guess so. Oh, not quite there. Okay, we'll just toe-to-toe, -to -toe, I guess. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, usual suspects, right, of course. Of course that's going to be the name of the team. I didn't even think about that. Well, that was easy enough. See ya. A righteous action. Man, Duelist is a lot of fun. The past is gone. Let it die. Love the versatility, dude. Alright, Loathing's still in a decent spot. We're heading left here for sure. Uh, it's not an oasis, that's a lair. There is an oasis over there, though. We don't have to get a trophy either. We do technically already have one from the Crusader's Helm. 
I'm gonna get my shields back, but apparently that's not an option. I do need some torch light here. In crisis, no gain is insignificant. Let's go, dude. Got the icebox buff from that. Whole bunch of food, hell yeah. Let's get rid of some of these combat items. I don't think I need the pods either. I guess I could chance removing the disease. Oh wait, never mind. Already got rid of it. I'm gonna use these pouch of lie as well, actually. It's been pretty helpful for us so far. And to the left. Giving us another resistance. All right, then. I think I'm pretty much going to focus entirely on just avoiding loathing for the remainder of this here. Seems like far and away the highest priority. Malaise. Measured and steady. And then this seems like... Oh, especially with that ordained dudes up front. Yeah, I was going to say, this is likely just going to be a pretty quick one for us here, especially if this works out. There we go. Early results are encouraging. That'll freaking do it, dude. Whoops. Whoopsie, buddy. Sorry. All right, second play grenade here, and we are in business, dude. No worries whatsoever. Oh, Magran was absolutely better there, too. I just realized that's okay, though, because I can do that. A lesson taught is a lesson learned. He's also dead. He's just straight up dead as hell. Oh, my goodness. Look at all her fun old tokens right there, man. She's having a great time. Three rounds, no sweat. We are the flame, burning brightly for all the world to see. This team's coming together real quick, dude. Duelist is just the hype woman. It's working, man. Whatever she's doing, it is effective. They revel in debauchery, debasing themselves in the face of the end. I think I want to hang it right after this. Let's actually defeat the enemies first, I suppose, but... It's probably the route we're gonna take here I can't stop doing meditation starts I'm gonna try prep this time be a little more aggressive see what that yields man it just feels real good to rock stuff out of the gate oh. goodbye Easily resolved. Although the Iron Swan might have been the better play there, but that was that was pretty satisfying too. Three speed tokens on our squad. That's a lot of fun. Old fast. For who knows what lurks in the beyond. Sadly, that's like kind of the inverse of one I wanted there, considering um. Oh, hold on a second, actually. I guess we just do the extra action here, couldn't we? Well, that's a little late. Never mind. Yeah, there's no reason to add that stress. Hey, Ribbon. Clear it out. Ah, oh, that was a pouch of lie opportunity. Shit. I gotta pay attention to that, dude. Would've been way better. All right, no mag rain here either. We'll just go ahead and hit him with that. Oh, yeah, the counter bleed, right? Oh, boy. Okay. Bleed from that, thankfully. No repose coming in here either. One taunt still up. She might be able to get a battlefield medicine sneaking in. At the end of this one. Ah, blind sucks. This team is working really well, yeah. Pretty happy with it so far for sure. Let's just do that. Because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be able to kill this lady before. Steady yourself. The next tick of bleed. Um sure. Doesn't really matter, I guess. Messy, but effective. Hooray! Another very good fight. Amidst the spoils. Whoa! An impact of unparalleled power. Okay. Looks like we gotta find a noxious item, dude. 
Oh, does anti-venom count? I don't think it does, does it? Nah, that's a concoction. There was a noxious item for us. Hmm. Oh, this... Oh, right, yeah, yeah. No, I've wanted this. I've wanted the Plague Doctor start. Disorienting Blast is now going to be worth considering. Especially because, yeah, Shuffle is pretty good for us. Okay. I don't think I need this anymore. Although I might still... Nah, I think we're sticking with Jealous Whisper most likely. I don't think we have anything that's noxious at the moment, unfortunately. The blades are deliverable, yes. Yeah, so we're trying to take this to the end at the moment. I don't think I want these anymore. I think I'm going to get rid of those. And then Fisherman's Net or Fisherman's Line is good. Without any serrated or Fisherman's Net items, though, it's a little worse. Oh, these are noxious. Oh, shit. We can equip these and just remember not to use them. And now we get the additional Blight Dell. Holy shit, that's good. Wow. Okay. Off we go then. Really nice. I'm going to go ahead and hang it right here and try to get to the Oasis, I think. Honestly, kind of tempting to go middle. Let's, let's try it out. Travel without proper reconnaissance. A hasty and reckless thing indeed. You would think that would be bad. That's actually pretty good, though. Safe route, and we reduce the loathing. Nice. Yeah, we already have a trophy PK because we brought the Crusader Helm along. Which I am fairly sure counts. But we'll get a warning, at least. If it a doesn't. Beautiful illusion that was the world. Fragmented and undone. Quick relationship check here. Yeah, looks like it's going to be good no matter what. Okay, let's do this. Yeah, we just finished up the Duelist backstory, Daniel, today. It's got all her skills fully unlocked. Oh, nasty shuffle for us. That's not good. Oh, boy. I think this probably just has to be a meditation to start again up front. Stealth is gone. Why not both, Siam? Okay, that works. This is a little awkward here, though. I think we'll have to let the Hellion toe-to-toe -to -toe first. Then we'll duelist after that. The duelist herself is going to have to probably stall a little bit. I don't know. This will work okay. Well done. I have a wasted crit there, but oh well. Play grenade. Ooh, disorienting to possibly bring the altar to the front. Also dazes that, which probably doesn't matter, but does create a single instance of uh, what's it called? Let us take a closer look at Rush the Judgment. As repulsive as it is. That's the one. All right, I guess we'll just preparation here. Yeah, it's probably fine. Actually, Touche might have, Yeah, Touche was better. I don't know why I didn't do that there. Red Shield is a death armor. Protects against a single death blow. Yeah, that's pretty good. Crit, though. Ideal. Okay. Now we're certainly looking at play grenades. And at this point, I suppose I could probably go for that. There's some broken armor. Nice. Go ahead and duelist advance into a kill there. Don't need to worry about those crits anymore. Time for... Eh, Magrain is better, isn't it? Yeah. Nice. Oh, it's a mechanic that replaces the typical death store resistance, though, Yastra, so it's not as bad as it seems. In fact, it's a lot easier to deal with than it used to be as far as enemy death door resistance is concerned. You are pretty much dead. 
think we'll let the DOT take care of that. Oh, yikes. Okay, that's going to have to be an adrenaline rush for sure. That is awful. Try this. Give him a crit. Fun. And a strength. All right, that's going to hurt. Holy hell. Bring her down. All right, let's get her fixed up real quick. There remains a foothold out of this mire. Hooray. Now climb. And how's this looking? Not great. I think we'll do that. Try for some repose damage here and move her back a little bit. That's a toe-to-toe, -to -toe, yeah. Ooh, that's a big heal, nice. Okay. Stress heal? In crisis, we can rely only upon each other. Just a buff, that's all good. Yet another crit though. God damn, that's unfortunate. We got crits too, at least. Subtraction, an invariable result. Oh, that's no repost, huh? Alright. Fair enough, I guess. Two crits now. Okay, we gotta get this guy getting heading toward the grave. A master stroke. I don't wanna deal with that. So let's go like oh yeah, the lack of noxious blast is already hurting me here, I feel like. Yeah, it's not gonna do much good. Five damage from the duelist. We can get that at least. And that's a dead lady. Another touche. And I think a howling end might do the job here. Close to it anyway. A little heal at least. Yo, Carantor! Thank you for the resubscription. Welcome back. Appreciate you. There we go. Done deal. Cut down these nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. Wow, they buffed this. This got even better. It's got a 20% chance to add two stealth tokens now. Huh. I wonder if that's better for anybody at the moment. The loathing of Bates. Yeah, that's decent for the Hellion. Let's try this out. I'm just curious enough. Off we go. Move set of duelists looks really nice. I've been having a lot of fun with it, yeah. Particularly, I like this path. It's unique and interesting. Yeah, I don't necessarily want her to be stealth, but I'm okay with seeing how it goes for a little bit. He's just dead. Oh my god, that was great. Hell of a start there, okay. Man, if we can start, like, taking out the back line immediately, that's going to be next level, dude. This is going to start being a little too strong, dude. The back-to-back -back primes, Karen Tor, and Aspen Arrow. Thank you for the support, guys. Give him some bear hugs, please. Welcome on back in. Welcome Show some love from the pile, please, and thank you. She's just dead to the blight, too. Oh, my God. That play grenade start was outstanding. Relief comes rarely in these Yay. Times. Savor it. Yeah, you're gone, you're gone. Sheesh. That trinket has made a tremendous difference Greater already. Threats await those who dare. Off we go. Hey Stubley. I've been very into it. Breathing some new life into the game for me for sure. And I believe we are closing in on that Crusader unlock. I wouldn't mind passing this fight. Although for 16 relics... That's a negative hit either way. Yeah, let's just do that. I think that'll be better. Lose some linens, I guess. Yeah, there we go. I don't think I need the Raven's Reach anymore either. All right, one more road fight, one more Oblivion encounter. 
We'll see about that crusader, baby. Start that play grenade start again. Yeah, that's pretty clearly the way to go. Collaboration confers advantage. Ooh, even the max hit there. Very nice. Miss it. Booyah. Golden. Absolutely perfect start. Even got the weakened attack up front. Nice. Oh, and there's a small chance this Hellion's actually able to just wipe this guy out, too. Holy cow. Ah, weak hit. He's dead to the Blight, though. Okay, let's see. Clearly need a toe-to-toe -to -toe here. Not going to be able to point blank. I think a take game's pretty nice, too. Battlefield again? Yep. Fix him up. Dead to the Blight. Let's go ahead and meditate. Owie. Stress and HP have just not been nearly as big of a factor as I thought that would be a for us here, too. And methodical appliance I have loved to see that. That is a mag rain for sure. Cooperation is the key. Send it. The fiend's strength dwindles. DOT on this boy is already near lethal. Absurd. He's gonna bounce his other boy back into the danger zone. Elementary. That was not nice. Suitably punished. Okay, three rounds, another one down. Sweet reprieve. Until the next test is put before I'm you. I'm glad I trusted my gut as far as this team composition goes, man, because they are kind of crushing it. We got a much better go going, or a much better attempt going with the duelist this time around. Here we go again. Not even ordained. Oh my god. See if we can take this dude out before the worship even comes into play. This is seeming pretty possible here. And with a howling end. Minimum hits, unfortunately, on the two big damage strikes, but even that might be enough to get the job done, especially with the blight in play. I'm gonna move that into play grenade territory. This is no time to falter. That hurt. Armor broken. One more hit, dude. He's done. Execution! A promising development. Yes! The enemy weakens and wanes. Holy shit. Altar down. Flesh weaving gonna be the regen here. All the focus on the tutor at this point. Hell yeah, brother. What the hell? Why? Where's that coming from? Oh, right, the Hellion. The fact that she's a Hellion. That's where that's coming from. Poke. A little more DOT than regen here, at least, but do have to deal with the crit disharmony still, unfortunately. But that's the, he, he's just dead. Goodbye. God damn, man. Well played, squad. Righteous action. They ain't getting past three rounds, dude. Not with this unit. Snap judgment. Oh boy. Another pretty good one. It's going to be tempting. Let's take a peek at what our speed looks like for everybody at the moment. Because, I don't know. Duelist might want that. At six base speed. Yeah, she could get real good real fast. I think I'm going to go with that. That sounds like fun. Do we have another Dark Impulse? Oh, right. We gave it to her. I don't think I need this anyway. Yeah, it seems like 
not the greatest thing in the world. So let's get rid of the bread, the anti-venom, and then we'll give her this, since that's actually pretty good for her already with the serrated item. We'll go like boom and boom, give you the apron. That is going to reduce her healing effectiveness. In fact, yeah, I don't know if I necessarily want that on her. I think I'll just do that. Hmm. I don't think I'm using apron anymore. Yeah. That'll be good. All right, I think we might finally get him. All are welcome here. Can I get some Deus Volt in chat? A little hype for our boy, who I think may be finally returning to us after all these years. Doth he return? Reconfigure. Meet each challenge on its own terms. Rest now for a time. The swords point to a the glinting sword light. Calls out to the swordsman. The last of the Crusaders will be All right. bound. Not quite. Not quite yet. Onward now and don't spare the horses. All right then. Planning and mindfulness. As vital to survival as sharpened steel. Getting the fancy version of the trophy equipped. Lights on the horizon. Okay. Dismas must make it to him alive. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. Every road a winding torment. Every turn bent on our destruction. We absolutely need to make that a priority, don't we? Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. We have heavily discounted trinkets here, which is going to result in a basically free nautical compass. Happy to pick that up. Blistering Bugle pretty good, too. Might as well snag that. We got ourselves another couple of songbooks, some pipe weed. We got plenty of food, I think, at this point. Let's see how these do. Braggart on the duelist is not terrific. That sucks. All right. We'll give the whiskey barrel a go. Hey, plus six, though. All right, that was worth it. And I think we just go ahead and feed him the cheese and bread here. Keep the steak and spuds for later. Cool. Nautical compass for our hellion sounds pretty fun. I do like that a lot. Yeah, let's do that. Seems good. Saying will help that a lot too, just in case she has to deal with the stress from that. Blistering Bugle could also be a better play than the Fisherman's Lion. Yeah, I think that's the way to go. Fisherman's Lion can just sit on the bench for now. Although it wouldn't be terrible. Oh, that's not a serrated item. Never mind. Okay, okay. Need to go to Tangle to continue Crusader Quest. Really? Yeah, all right then. Guess we're going Tangle. Trenches and tents. The front lines of a war that was never fought. Hmm. I did want to do preparation. It's not great, though. I don't know. Touche, maybe? Oh, yeah, that's right. Touche gives her the stance. And would give her the aggressive stance in rank three. That's pretty damn good. I should upgrade the play grenade. I'm gonna upgrade disorienting as well. I guess I could do preparation. That's pretty good. What are the entries for? For a giveaway. I believe that message is still pinned. Type Deus Volt into the chat if you'd like to be entered into the giveaway for a chance at a Steam key for this DLC that I'm playing right now. Alright, no other noxious trinkets. 
Not any trinkets I really care about getting here either. Yeah, nothing all that fantastic. Okay. I'm going to grab this and roll the dice on it real quick. That was a tremendous waste. Okay. Um, shit. I guess I should just get these. Yeah, that's going to be way better, isn't it? Let's take the guaranteed result. And we can bring them into a friendly relationship. Duelist in the highway, man. That seems pretty good. Okay. Combat items looking good here as well. We're saving the rest of those in things. Good stuff. Okay. I think we're ready. Yeah, pretty well decked out here. Let's do it. While the heart still beats, desire will never die. Heal 10% off the Wicked Slice is pretty sick. Aspiration unites the hopeful. Hey, Thunder. Prep and tracking shot or a stress heal. Nice. Adrenaline rush will be a stress heal as well. Cool. All right, all right. And the boot. I still want to try it. Mostly due to a desire to see the animation. Yeah, we'll take that. That's pretty good. War. Rewards only. Unique bark. Unique bark from Dismas. He said, hold on, my friend. I'm coming. Ah, I love that. Okay. So I'm not really sure whether or not we actually have to go to the Tangle here. I kind of just took somebody's word for it. Ooh, there's a Shambler altar at the end. The Cage Knight. There he is. Guaranteed encounter. Let's go. Hell yes. All right. So it's sort of up to us to decide what to do prior to that. I don't think I need to go to another correct Chirurgeon's table here. Let's head to the right. Let's make damn sure we get to our boy. The destination's never in question. Only the route you take to get there. Assistance encounter is more than welcome. Let's see if I can't keep the stagecoach in decent shape on the way there, too. I might even have to go for that middle route, keeping that in mind. Looks like it's a safe route after that, too. So, yeah, that'll probably be the path we take. Might even be able to repair the wheels. No luck, but we can scout. And we get the relationship bonus there, which is nice. Let's see what we got going on. Pretty helpful. Watchtower is worthwhile here, too, considering the speed bonus. Moving. Gets Pawn closer to uh, being able to take advantage of that trinket. Yeah, I may end up going through the lair here just because we aren't certain that we're going to have a trophy after the Crusader encounter. All right, we're gonna hit assistance again. An elementary problem, is it not? Cash is tempting, but I really want to try to get the stagecoach to be in good shape. Hoping that we can repair the wheels here. An oasis, of course, is a welcome sight. Ambush! Stop it! Come on! All right, moving back. That's probably not a point blank there either. I feel like that's probably going to have to be a take aim. And yeah, we saw him coming. Not that it mattered, I guess. Huh? Uh, Touche start. Sure. Pretty good. Ooh, nice. Incremental. But deadly all the same. Ah, the belief. You do love to see it. Glorious victory, hell yes. I believe too. I got I got a singular objective here, man, and you better believe I'm gonna make it happen. Seven damage with the hit. And blight for 30. 
Holy shit. We found the damage. Let's see here. I like a howling end, sure. Followed up with a point blank. Actually, this is possibly in Wicked Slice Execution territory. But it's an option next round. A master stroke. Although it would have been maybe better to do the take aim into speed, but nah, it's probably fine. There he goes. She's dead. She, they're all dead. Goodbye. I'm just going to go ahead and prep just to... I'm just going to hold up my middle fingers here. Just say, see ya. Bye-bye. See you later. Pass turn. Just move. Just to mock them. You silly fools. You dared mess with the God Squad? The unrelenting application of violence yields morbid games. Get the frick out of here. Woo-hoo-hoo. -hoo, and a greater hail draft. Somehow not good enough to equip. I absolutely prefer to have the blistering bugle here. That's wild. Man, we are in a real good spot, dude. Things seem to be going better today. It is night and day, honestly. By comparison here, this team is crushing it. Giving in to madness is easier than holding out against it. They are heroes. Sadly, no wheel repair, but this is tempting. Oh, yeah, dude. Thank you. Give those a use. Actually, I'm going to hang on to those for the end game, too. This is really good for the end game. Getting decked out. Let's go. Oasis time as well. We got the study coming up. Hitting the lair. We even have a hospital by the end of this, dude. We are going to be in great shape. Although the way that looks, it is kind of tempting, actually, to preserve our armor for the end of the region. But I also kind of want to fight the Shambler. It's a little tempting. Scavenge what you can and be off once more. I know that I shouldn't, considering the fact that... We have the whole Crusader thing to worry about here. And it would feel pretty stupid to die to a Shambler fight immediately prior to the Crusader fight. Love you. Have a good day. Nice loathing resistance there, by the way. Rummage through the shelves, laden with echoes of indistinct ideas. I don't love the relationship interactions here, but I'm willing to take a chance on this stuff. Each enemy on round start shuffle, each hero on combat start shuffle. I kind of love it. Especially with this team. And the crocodilian equipped, I kind of love it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to goof up and do that right there, man. That's a content trinket for sure. Yeah, that's fun. Do it. Randomness favors the enemy, but it shuffles them every round as opposed to only starting us or only shuffling us on combat start. A trinket meets plague doctor goes to the front. I know, but we've dealt with that already a couple of times. It wasn't really even that bad. So worst case scenario still, I think, works out pretty well for us. Not to mention, again, it's going to give us a bonus to damage immediately. So we're almost certainly not fighting the general here. Within every Although, king, again, a general and his loyal lumbering guard. Worth considering the possibility that we're not going to have this trophy after we find the Crusaders, so might need to do it. Oh, that's a good question, Shadow. I don't think the general can be moved, though. I'm pretty sure you can't actually move him. Or in the tap route, for that matter. So yeah, I probably won't work on them, but interesting consideration. Crusader's more important than the mountain. Yeah, but if we get both, 
That'd be nice. General and Root have a permanent immobile token. Right, yeah, okay. So no luck there. I'm already kind of loving the shuffle situation. And this dude's dead as hell. See you. Touche moving up. Another one down. A deliberate and methodical appliance of harm. Possibly get into wicked slice territory with this boy. Especially with the crit. I think it might already be there. Let's give it a look. Oh, come on. We'll heal the Hellion a little. We'll get a crit heal for the Hellion, actually. Nice, but... Yeah, no luck. I like meditation here, yeah. Do, 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 do. Lethality writ large. Whoopsie daisy. Sorry, fella. That's a mag ran, isn't it? Yep. Do, 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 do. An invariable result. And for fun. Not to mention another heal for the Hellion. Nice. Gotta be doing that more, actually. Nah, just leave. No, nah, just keep going. Yeah, keep going. Keep going. It's worth it. It's worth it. Well, I mean, we're OP right now. We're gonna destroy this fight. Even sans proper preparation, I think this is gonna be pretty simple for us here. Well, this will definitely give us a better idea. Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. Um, let's toe to toe to begin with. Yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. Miss it. Ow. No one comes to aid a brigand. I mean, should they? I suppose it depends on your sense of justice. Dissection. An unavoidable end. A known thief lies bleeding on your doorstep. Do you intervene? Type one if you save his life. Type two if you leave him to die. We'll decide just how, just how just the pile really is. Oh, they're all gonna go help him out, of course. Of course you are. Although there's a couple of real capital punishment F MFers out there. Option four, eat him. I'm very curious what option three was. You're jumping right to there. Ooh, the stun on the knight. Very good. Okay. I like that a lot. What's the name of the class that threw snakes at the enemies? I believe you're thinking of the Shield Breaker. Which we've yet to see any appearance of. Stupendous. Here in DD2. Be gay, do crime. Amen. Hmm. This would reduce Motel's stress. Not that we need that, I guess. This has just got to be a touche, right? Yeah. This is no time to falter. That's an adrenaline rush. Can heal again. That's a big heal. Stops the adrenaline rush, but a breakthrough might not matter. Question mark. Oh shit. Oh, that daze is actually pretty helpful, though. Pretty good stuff there. I think I need to tr tick down one more time on the death armor, which means doing this. And then we say sayonara. Execution! With a crit heal the boot, let's go. Read out, that's all you had to say. That's all I needed to see. He has retreated, undying, into a dream, and there he must stay. This this is a phenomenal start. Holy shit! 
Wow. Okay. Yeah, go ahead and prep right away. I'm gonna get a strengthened Howling End. Max damage. Into a crit strengthened point blank. Wow! That's a cool 70 damage out of the gate, by the way, if you're curious, if you're doing the numbers on that one. With the Blight to boot. We're gonna speed run this fucking general fight, man. All right, let's see here. Oh, this is the aggressive stance. I do very much like the ruthless instruction here. Again, could also be quite good. Hmm. Primarily benefiting her, but obviously that's not the play at the moment. It's not actually all that great here. I think I might even prefer this, especially with her being the target of the roots already. 37 plus 32. Nice. Didn't even notice. That's the ideal start indeed. Feels a bit like a waste, but this could absolutely be a an, or an iron swan situation here. 7 to 10, 7 to 14. Take aim's not bad. I do kind of like that. Oh, we have Pouch of Lie to use on the taproot here as well, I just realized. That's pretty good. Yeah, waste a crit, obviously, there, but I think it's better to clear the vines in that moment. Big repost, good stuff. Narrow, narrow, narrow. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. A small reprieve from the pip, nice. Of horrors. It's pretty good. Uh, let's see. No need to give any crits anywhere. Prep doesn't really help. I suppose I'm just going touche again. This feels... It's not ideal, but it is pretty good. Okay. Almost certainly a play grenade there. Giant blight stacking up now. Holy cow. That's pretty great. Oh, this is chalk dust. I thought this was pouch of lie. Well, this is even better to use here. Yeah. That's fantastic to use there. Let's get into point blank territory again. How hard is duelist to learn? Kind of intimidated to start right now. It's don't don't be. It, it's not that bad. There's a lot going on. Like in the beginning, you'll have to take a, a couple extra moments to p and just pay attention to all the possible outcomes. But all. I don't 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 let it scare you off. It's it's not that bad. All right, we got the taunt at least. Obviously, need to try to heal the plague doctor here. He's another laudanum as well. Is probably wise. Hmm, we might actually just have to race him down real quick. A master stroke. That'll help. Weaken them that another may finish the work. Wow. Please don't murder her. Thank you. Oh wait, no, you you might still murder her. Shit. Oh, come on, man. Such a wholesale organic failure. Literally right there. Jeez. That stinks. Oh, well. For every miscalculation, a consequence. You do get to keep the otherworldly fragments, at least. Just making space for the Crusader, right? <laughs> the loathing abates. Ah, oh, shit, dude. Okay. Should have had some healing cells available. There's some bear bucks for you, yeah. This is a lot of stuff we have to get rid of, too. Don't need silent treatment anymore. Probably a little late for collector chandelier at this point. Readout's pretty good. We'll go with this. Go with 
getting rid of that. No more faceless visage, I guess. No more plague doctor trinket. And we'll get rid of that, and we'll get rid of the bread. There we go. Unfortunate, but what are you gonna do? Now we obviously just gotta try to find the easiest path there, which is probably gonna be the right, I guess, with the two assistance encounters at the end. We keep our wheels intact, thankfully. This would also allow us to keep our armor for the end fight, or well, assuming it's an end fight. How <laughs> you feel about that shamble? Yeah, no, I think we'll probably just go ahead and skirt on over to the right Chaos side now. Be met with unwavering resolve. Oh, thanks. Definitely gonna try to avoid these fights for the remainder of it here too. Oh, this is going to destroy our wheel. Shit. That's unfortunate. Unless we get really lucky with the assistance encounter prior to that. No, thank you. What's a few lost relics? That's how I'm, that's how I'm seeing a duelist. At least it should be. Certainly the case now. Head, a bestial refuge littered with bones and less identifiable remains. Let's see how you do 3v3 here, fellas. Hmm, prep again? Do we need a little bit of stress healing here anyway? Worthwhile. Incremental. But deadly all the same. I'm gonna force you to fight the creature, Dan. I'm kind of banking on it, yeah. I'm prepping for it. Keep on shuffling, y'all. Yeah, we're getting aggressive. Owie. Measure out your violence. And apply it judiciously. I'm gonna have to look for a way to try to stress heal over here before the end of this as well. Ah, the Crusader, you've arrived just in time. How fitting. Because I believe we are about to encounter him. I'd be pretty shocked if this wasn't it, so. He's well on the way here. Well, him, there we go. A small reprieve from the carousel of horror. Didn't even realize. Okay, then we got a toe to toe finish. Looking good. Crusader arrives precisely when he means, when he means to, clearly. Another stress heal. That is really nice, actually. Yeah, it's an extremely good. Benefit to that skill. I'd love it if you stop doing that though That's been pretty shitty Sadly, I don't really have the means to Target her at the moment. I can't stress you though Meditation You can just go ahead and target right there for me or we can just do that to you. Yeah, that'll work. Bye. Bye in decent shape. Highwayman's HP is a little low, but we are should be flame, fine. Burning brightly for all the world to see. And if we go, can I get some bare luck? All that we can muster, in fact. Two things: one, to avoid this creature den fight, and the next, to ideally repair the wheels at the assistance encounter, which is why we're going to need every last bit of it. Yeah, we got to go ahead and equip those salves as well. That's a good call. Just in case. I guess the bone saw doesn't really matter for her anymore either. Come on, let me do it. Avoid? Avoid? Let's go! Run away! Run away! Safe route. Come on, assistance. Let us temper this world's cruelty. Just a little Just more luck. A little. Just a little more luck, Wayne. That's all we want. We got a full inventory again, too. Sheesh. Um, get rid of 
that. There we go. And the bread, I guess. Well, not that we got any. Everybody say, hi, Collector. Don't you do this to me. No, thankfully, you can't Let pop up here. Wheels, please. Can be eased. Wheels. No, man. Eh, I get the torchlight, at least. That's pretty good. Time for a repair fight. Crap. Right before the damn cage night, too. With three people, it's going to be real bad. We just got to hope that the encounter itself isn't too punishing. This is where that bear luck comes in, right? That's not too bad. Work fast and fight even faster. Not awful. Shadow Touche away. And we. And goodbye. Very close there. Bit of Hellion's repair turn here, unfortunately. Steady yourself. That'll help. Repair the wagon. Okay. Oh, yikes. Okay, we're going to need some taunt or something early on here. Nah, man. Unable to use the salve there. I do a spring water, I guess, if I want to go that route, but... That seems better here. All right. Duelist might be able to get a kill off this. Uh, not not going to happen, but we should do that. Get a pip out of it, too. Good stuff. That seems worth... It's going pretty good. Agony by accumulation. I'm gonna get our numbers advantage in a sec. Ah, that stun is brutal though. Shit. I'm gonna get one at least. And the regen too, right? Of course. Stun and repair. Oof. Numbers certainly in our favor though. This, I believe, just adds a chance for them to gain stress on the turn. That's all that exclamation point is, I'm pretty sure. That's prep. Yeah, that's definitely prep. Man, they're getting lucky with how much damage they've been able to do so far here. A little repose going at least, speed token that time. Yikes. God damn, the stress piling up on there for her too. I got spring water I definitely need to try to use by the end of this. Ooh, I should be able to get another regen here as well, actually. Cooperation is the key. Which will be quite nice. Hell yeah. Okay. So I just want to try to stall this out a little bit now, don't we? I'm going to use a salve here, too. Let's see. So I really just want to try to get a spring water turn on the Hellion. Well, oh, never mind. All right. That'll work. Cut down these nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. Here we go, dude. One last encounter. Assistance, not really a factor at this point, I guess. Maybe just try to find some combat items or something. And then we got a road barricade and then the caged knight. <laughs> Look, the wheels are fixed, right? Yeah, hooray. Ah, oh, boy. That sucks that we got to take a negative relationship hit there, too. I don't want any of that. Yeah, you keep all that garbage. Right on. Dismas says it's time to go. That's right. Yeah, he's got... He's got a friend to save, damn it. The vestiges of an invading army. Scattered and lost in this dying land. He, uh, he ain't about to let a goddamn barricade stop him from getting there. Although I don't like that they turn that into a week in there. That kind of sucks. Let's start with a point blank, actually. Take aim into the point blank. I like that a little better. Now we need to do this. Relief comes rarely in these times. Spring water all day. And I guess I could start here. That's pretty damn good. 
Duelist does have a stress heal, yeah, but I'll probably just go ahead and use the spring water to bring it down to zero. Because I've got other stuff I'm going to use for the end game combat items anyway. Goodbye, barricade. God damn, that was nice. Be able to point blank the big old swordsman right away. This is a big bleed, though. Don't love that. Another crit, though. Holy cow. Um, we should meditate. Oh, right. That's gonna be taunts. I should have thought of that. Oops. Perhaps they have given their last. Whoopsie daisy. Sorry. Forgot about that part. Here, we'll get we'll get you out of there. Hang on. I'll get you a duelist advance out of there. Let me give you a salve too. There you go. And then depart from this position. Oh, but hang on. Ooh. Ooh, that's a little too good not to do. Sorry, lady. Well done. Got to put you right back up there, apparently. We have two taunts that we're working with uh, this time, at least, though, so... Apparently, they don't have a sound effect for the missed jab, either. Hey, yeah. Hey, Venom. Another crit. Holy cow, Nautical Compass has been popping off here. Yeah, there's way too much DOT. Critting all day, too, though. Getting some stress relief as well. Nice. Down to zero again. Another one down? Or down to one, I guess. Variable. Easily resolved. I'm looking to dodge. That's okay, though. We're in pretty good shape here. Cool. Okay. Sort it out. Greater threats await those who dare. A few more laudanum. Very nice. Hey, just came back from dinner. What happened to the plague doctor? You went to dinner. You should have known. What would happen if you chose to do that? Oh boy, it's finally time. The caged knight. I'm excited for this. Let's see here. I'm thinking it's probably wise. A renewal. Welcome back. To keep all of our possible healing items equipped, I think I also might want to go with a smoke bomb. I have no idea what to expect here, but I feel I should be prepared. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh shit! After uncountable seasons, the humiliated warlord has made good his vendetta. Dude, hello, the warlord. He's got six moves. Yeah, that intro was dope. Guards, allies behind. Currently vulnerable. That's pretty good for me. Well, let's get started. He's got a necklace of ears. He does. Analysis is the natural prelude to action. That's upsetting. Well, that's a good start for us, at least. Oh, yeah! Strength and crit repose. How about a couple of smoke bombs? No luck? All right, fine. Uh, do that. Ooh. Paro. He's going to add dodge or block plus. Ferox impetus. Utilizes the combo token. Okay. That's going to be a salve situation. A calculated generosity. Believe that's a point but blank. A one, nonetheless. Let me get us moving around again. Get those buffs going. Unlucky with the smoke bombs. Yikes. He's going to have multiple actions here, too. I think I actually might want to go with a meditation. Yeah. Seems pretty good here. I really got to get some taunts up on the Hellion as well. Oh, they're going to move him to the back. That's interesting. We'll see what he does there. Cohorter. Oh, boy. 
Okay. Oh, that's going to get through his block plus, though. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's ideal. Move forward again as well there. Nice. No blocks either. Oh, but Jesus Christ, the damage is getting up there already, and then they're going to be acting first here, too. Sheesh. What the hell, man? Do I have another salve ready? No, I do not. God damn it. God damn it. Hmm. I'm pretty sure I need to touche. Oh, that's right. Wicked Slice heals the Hellion. That's very smart. Oh, come again, on. Teetering on that terrible precipice. That's frustrating, dude. Uh, so damn close here. This is very frustrating. A wicked Slice sadly is not going to pierce through that. Collaboration confers advantage. I think we might just duel this here, actually. Yeah, I think that's probably for the best. His execution is not going to get through it, so... Okay. Ideal. Extremely good. But effective. Go dismiss. He's saving his boy whether anyone's here with him or not. He's got a damn job to do. Actual hero shit. He's done it, man. The hard carry at the end. Let's go. Hell yeah. We've completed the Lost Crusade and we've returned our boy to his home. Let's go. Crusader unlocked. That was a dope quest. I really liked that. Securus. Gain on killing blow. All allies behind gain strength. And block. Or all allies ahead gain block. Oh, that's cool. A reusable combat item, the, tr the Tropium. Adds combo. A five turn cooldown. That's pretty neat. Hell yeah, man. Wow. That's awesome. We got him. And we should be able to put him in the lineup when we get to the end here, I, I assume. Which is also pretty sick. Let's get rid of that cheese. So we really want to try to keep these trinkets. Because we don't need that much lot in them, do we? Hmm. Speed bag, maybe? Probably not the greatest thing to have. And then... Let's do bone saw, maybe. Uh, I still don't think I need that much laudanum, actually. And that many thunderclap grenades is a little overkill. Probably get rid of the hail draft, too. We do still have the... Tr or, no, we don't have the trophy anymore, I don't think. Oh, we do have the trophy. But I might, it might go when we get to the inn. I guess we'll find out. Oh boy, I'm I'm ready to have the Crusader back. This is exciting. How cool was it that Dismas carried the fight at the end? Really, yeah, it felt pretty scripted. I'm pretty pleased with it. The fire is lit. The table is set. 
The inn awaits its favorite guests. Hell yeah, brother. A few more candles for you, boy. Big time mastery points and let's get him. Let's get him. Let's go. He's back. And we'll bring out... I think we'll do the occultist. I feel like I haven't done the occultist in a little bit, too. And we obviously need a healer again, so... That'll do. Hell yeah. We got to get a fresh pick me going, y'all. This is an exciting one. Make sure you get P-I-C-K-M-E in the chat if you'd like to be entered into the drawing. We're going to make sure this is just the folks that we've got here as well. So, in fact, let me do a brand, brand spanking new one. So go ahead and do it again if you just did it just now. P-I-C-K-M-E in the chat. We're going to draw new names here for our occultist first. And then we'll do a drawing for our crusader. Oh, this is exciting. The inevitable end of your journey awaits you once again. And it looks like we did actually keep the Helm and Blade. In fact, we can't replace the Helm and Blade. It's still locked in for this quest, so... There's that. Which is good, honestly, because the General's Dream would have been a terrible tri or a terrible trophy for us anyway. A smoother ride. For a time, at least. All right. Not a lot of concern here as far as trinkets go. We got a lot of whiskey. That's nice to see. We don't need any food, do I? Yeah, I think we're good on food. Let's find out what gear we're going to give him first of all. I feel obligated to do that. Although, well, I don't know, actually. God, he's so good looking. Look at this guy. The Crusader, man. He's back. We got to look at the skills here, too. Smite, naturally. An additional 50% damage when target is comboed. Well, clearly, we need to give you this. Stunning blow stuns when target comboed. He's got Klepto! Oh my god, come on. That's gotta be scripted. There's no way that's not scripted. Stunning blow off combo targets. Zealous Accusation will burn and has a chance to apply combo. He's got the burn. We got more burn damage, dude. We're getting, like, exactly what I wanted to see out of this guy. Inspiring cry for the stress reduction. Rallying cry to remove, daze, and weaken. Remo Ooh, to remove stun. Also removes weaken on himself. Cool. Yeah, finally another burn skill, huh? I'm really excited for that for sure. Bloodthirsty as well is phenomenal. Okay. As fun as Securus is, I think actually... Nautical Compass is going to be a better play here. This is probably better for, like, earlier on in the run, but I think at this point it's a little less useful. I'm going to get all them Thunderclap grenades in there, dude. Scrap grenade, too. And then I think we'll have Fragments, uh, Springwater, Bonesaw, and I suppose we could probably use Tropium for the end game as well. Yeah, that's pretty good. All right, quick Provisioner check. Conventional fair. I think we pick up both whiskey bottles. Maybe the pipe weed here as well, although it's a little less tempting. All right, we have the occultist stuff to set up here as well. I could even consider changing his path Practice. Improve. with our remaining relics. That doesn't seem like a terrible idea. But I don't know. I think I'll probably be okay with just the default occultist here. Keep his heal equipped. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. Pole's going to be really nice, too. In fact, I might even go ahead and upgrade that. Let's see what our upgraded Crusader skills look like. Not a huge change there. This will remove strength and crit on the target, which is pretty cool. Zealous increases the combo chance. Ah, self-stress heal and the target stress heal with Inspiring Cry. That's pretty good. Those aren't super appealing at the moment. I think I'll focus on some other stuff first. Bigger heals from that. I like the Abyssal heal too, or the Abyssal upgrade as well. We'll probably be doing some chaotic offering here. I mean, I just upgrade his full kit, I guess. I think the Zealous is pretty good. Inspiring Cry is pretty damn good too. I'll probably roll with that. I don't think I need to upgrade the Chaotic Offering. I can do the Wicked Slice, I suppose, and then... Let's see. 
I think we're doing pretty good at that point. F it, dude. There you go. Good stuff. And now let's check our relationships here. See if I can make friends with the new folks. That'll work. Nice. We gotta get them to be kind to each other as well. Would really love to avoid unfriendly interactions here, obviously, but that's gonna be easier said than done. I'm pretty sure I don't want to spend the relics on a path change at this point either, so... Might just be buying a shitload of whiskey here. The songbook is pretty damn tempting, too. Although Melophobic, obviously, is going to make it so it's less effective, especially given that that's the one I mostly wanted to do it to. Don't have a stimulating poultice this time, do I? No, unfortunately. That would be really nice here, too. Real difficult to make friends here. Yeah, it's going to be tricky. Let's get them fed first. Reynold gets well taken care of there. Yeah, you have some disease resist too. Gonna give you a little bit more crit maybe? Let's do that for the duelist, I guess. And then I do think I'm probably just gonna buy a whole bunch of whiskey flasks at that point. So that will make a difference here. Last call for the pick me if you'd like to be chosen here as well. We got our very Something first crusader. The rigors of the road. Choose the name for this time around. P I C K M E in the chat. Let's get the occultist and duelists to be buddies, at the very least. I was hoping for some plus two there. That'll work. Plus two, plus two, duelist and crusader. That'll do it. All right, now we're just worried about these guys, which thankfully the chance is not too bad. We also do have a couple more whiskey flasks if I want to take a gamble on that. Although there's really not a way unless we get two plus twos that we'd be able to fix it, so that seems kind of wasteful. Instead, we'll do Duelist, Highwayman, and Highwayman Occultist. Oh, never mind. No, we won't. Instead, we could go with... I suppose that is our best shot. Let's gamble on it. F it. I'll get wasted. I'll probably feel a little bit better that way, at least. And then we got trinkets for the occultist. Pretty straightforward there. Cool. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is still not fantastic at the moment. I think we're ready to draw this name, my friends. Let's find out who our very first crusader is going to be. We're going to draw the occultist first here. That very last call for the pick me, if you'd like to be selected. Starting with semi-stable, an excellent name for our occultist. And our very first crusader. That's a bear bongo for our drum roll, please. Bear Bongo, which is now an official twitch.tv slash Bear Taffy emote. No longer BTTV necessary. Who's it gonna be? -da 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 Winner is Newest Mutant. That seems like a fitting name, too. I also like that it fits exactly within the character limit. Let's go. Welcome into the team. Motels on the Moon, Pond Jugular, Newest Mutant, Semi-Stable. Mutant was pulled last time, too, weren't they? Pa I mean, not Pond. It's not your fault, Pond. It's Moobot. I don't know why I confuse you two. I'm going to go ahead and blame, blame Pond anyway. Damn it, Pond. Stop rigging the poll. Right. Okay. I think we're good, man. Let's hit it. Back to the mountain, baby. With the Crusader! <laughs> Let's freaking go! No negative relationships. We are ready. We are ready to go. At last, the great Ziggurat. Temple of failure and regret. 
I've, I've felt fewer moments more befitting of a spam of the emote bear hero for the glorious return of Reynold. So excited to get him in the mix, man. And of course, you know, you, you know we're bringing the old guard back. Let's do it. Should have changed party order. That's a good idea. Their power wanes when they stray from the abyss. Maybe they'll be friends by the end after all. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's got to be the usual suspects, though, Captain. We were just talking about that. A slow dissection. Although I like that name, too. An unavoidable end. But, you know, that is the... Uh, that's that's what it's got to be. Boil it down. We'll get into our defensive stance here, so we at least have an opportunity to get the Crusader in the mix. That's a hell of a start there for us. That's a hell of a start there for us. Wow. Crits for everybody. And the bear optimal for the altar boy. Or for the trumpet boy, I mean. All right, clearly wise to use that as early and often as possible, especially if it adds more crits to the big guy. We love that. God damn it. <laughs> this is not ideal. Um, come here. Hey, it's done there. All right, we'll take it. All right, yeah, of course, the unchecked power. Try again? That is just not going my way, dude. Maybe I'll get the Crusader in range at least now, though. A couple of stuns, too. Oh, speaking of which, stunning blow. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. A guaranteed stun. Those are still a thing? That's incredible. Stun off a combo anyway, but still. I know, I thought those were out of commission. I thought they stopped making them. It's a miracle. Oh, it's execution time, my friend. That's going to be a burst. That's all right, though. Unless... Oh! Ho -ho! Welcome back, Alhazred. What a shot. Prevents the explosion. That's clean, dude. That animation of pulling the sword back. Oh, I didn't even notice. Man, I'm so hyped. I'm forgetting to pay attention to the details. I got to look out for that. Okay, here we go. We are going with fragments, spring water, bone saw. Bone saw is ready. Let's do it. Dump the rest. It's all trash. Who needs it? Except this thing. I want to keep it for fun. And the general's dream just for bragging rights. Otherwise, let's go! Behold, also the party order. The source of the stain. Thank you. Gateway to incomprehensible. Let's go! Emptiness. Back to the mountain once more. The seething sigh ain't gonna know what hit it! The seething sigh. Stertorous avatar of ill-concealed rage. Doesn't this just look right to you guys? It's finally fixed. Look at all this over here. This is this is darkest dungeon. We're back, baby. Hell yeah. Abyssal? I don't think we care. I think we're going all in on the side. Let's see, I want preparation, yes. Yes, ah, ah, ah. Combo stun, oh my God. Ow, oh, you jerk. All right, not guaranteed, I guess. A little overzealous there, am I right? Yuck, yuck, yuck. Not a lot of shuffling going on anymore, obviously, so our crocodilian's a little less effective, but should be good. 
A reverberating redoubt for the boy. Okay, no more rear lung, please. He knows what he's doing. We're probably going to have to hit that with the burning stars, I'd guess. Let me go ahead and pop a mineral spring water right away to reduce that stress. And then let's see here. How do I feel about again? I think I like it a lot. I think I like it very much. I think we're going to get some big time smites going. Blight there, at least. Cleared the rear lung. Ooh, that's nasty. That might just have to be a take aim here, I think. Oh, it's on cooldown, right? Still a very satisfying sound effect. I know it always comes from a miss, but it still makes me happy st for some reason. Pleases my brain. Let's see here. This has almost got to be a smite, right? Yeah. He's getting a lot of damage out of that. Stop doing that. You know I can't deal with it. God damn it. I like this, and then we can go into preparation from that. That's pretty good. I suppose Abyssal's going to be the play still, right? Yep. We're so close to actually having the damage there. I wish I'd or I wish I'd gotten pistol shot prior to this. I guess that would probably be the better move. I gotta pay attention to this again. Yeah, no, that's right. Does he? Pull okay, he's gonna pull out the scroll from the back pocket, right? Then the inspiring cry where he prepares for it. Oh yeah, dude. Oh, that's good. I like that a lot. Yeah. Oh, it's so good to have the boy back. Clear that block plus. Hell yes. No luck on the dodge there, but the stress is weirdly helpful, although the blind is definitely going to hurt that. Can you just stop? One time, go ahead and hit us with the old freaking front lung, dude. I gotta be like this. You know, another burning stars at least, but come on, man. Oh my god! And the dodge plus ain't gonna work either. I'm feeling kind of fricked right now. Okay. The greatest test of all. First one resolute. Damn it. This is bad. You're not just gonna. He will find his way home. Uh... Welcome to the bear pile. One hundred percent of the rounds so far have been the rear lung. That's just ridiculous, dude. The path of exculpation. He'd not be alone. Yeah, naturally, he's the first one to die. A monkiliar! A few bear hugs scattered in there, please. Thank you very much for the resubscription. Welcome back in. Sorry for the new subscription. Brand new member of the pile. Give him some bear hugs, please. Oh, boy. <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> I'm going to do this and just force a fucking... Resolve check. Quiet, oh, wait, mind. no, that's the opposite of what I thought it was. Never mind. That's fine then, I guess. I'm so fucked, dude. A master stroke. I'm dead. Darkness encroaches. Inexorable. Oh, goodness. Hey! Not just the rear lung this time. See, he's looking out for you. Dismiss wins these. I love it. I believe. Never he mind. Drift among the stars. Death door resistance is a myth. It's not real. Dodge. 
Holy shit. Seriously, off the one damage from what? The nautical compass or something? The hell was that? Exhaustion takes hold. Okay, we get one shallow here. It took one damage from something. I don't even know what triggered it. Uh, let's see. Oh, is the dark impulse. The stress damage chance. Jesus, that would have been a shitty way to lose him, too. All right, well. Yeah, that makes sense. See ya. Not Sometimes you just get fricked, dude. Sometimes it's just not going to work out. And seething uh, seething sigh still got something to say, huh? Suffering succotash. Heck of a run, though, man. Yeah, absolutely. Of course, got the Crusader unlock. Another I'm pretty happy with that. Another loss. Dismiss lost hope after re reuniting with his boy and losing him again. He gets to rescue him only to see him slaughtered before his eyes immediately. Yeah, that's a that's a fun redemption story. All right. Well, of course, we know what we're doing next time here, y'all. It's the usual suspects. We gotta get some hero shrines for our boy, the Crusader, and get him upgraded and ready to go. So let's go spend some candles. Speaking of which, how about that? If you're watching over on YouTube, Big thanks for the support over there via the likes on the videos. They help quite a bit. The algorithm loves them. Up ahead, a light in the limitless expanse. Thanks for the support, y'all. Let's get some unlocks real quick. Look to those who have known fear and failure in ample portion. Pretty easy choice here, clearly. Get a couple indelible trinkets for the boy, some paths. A front rank fighter who cleanses and slays with holy fire, the aggressor. A little more light, a little more strength. If relics in inventory less than 10, plus 10% crit chance. Target reap skills, steel reap skills. What the heck is that? I wonder. Templar path, of course, the Templar the path. Splendor of a world. Those who live within it. Apply to attacker when hit, one burn. Radiant skills deal an additional burn dealt. Okay. And then the banneret. An armored supporter with improved reach, capable of healing and wide range buffs. Nice. And then finally, the unique reliquary. Plus 5% stress resist per negative token, plus 5% damage per positive token. He will retire his battered helm atop a scarecrow and labor the land beneath its baleful gaze. Oh, yeah, we know we got to do those cosmetics, too. Absolutely. You know it. Mutations of an idea, iterations of a soul. And then I suppose that's all we had to spend the candles on, isn't it? Variety. Superfluous for some. A necessity for others. Which is fine with me. Let them be properly attired for the apocalypse. Beautiful. Should have just enough. Tools and trappings. The regalia of a life. Alright, there we go. Last few here. And that is it. Our boy has returned fully geared up. And look forward to bringing him out next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you then.